Hello lovely! Welcome back to my channel. So there's going to be a little background noise but just ignore that. Um, today I am excited to start a fitness challenge. Now I am not like the most in shape person obviously. I am a foodie. I love my food. But what, with this quarantine I've actually found a lot more time to exercise and work out and it has brought me so much comfort and joy and I actually look forward to my different workout days. So during one of my many sleepless nights, because this has anyone else's sleep cycle been totally messed up by this lockdown because now I don't fall asleep until like four, five, six in the morning sometimes. But anyway, during one of my sleepless nights I was on YouTube and apparently there's like this two week challenge to get abs and I'm like hmm I've got nothing better to do I'm kind of like halfway there so this looks interesting and I was actually already planning on doing a mini series of fitness videos anyway so I'm like huh look at god like just I think of what is manifestation let's go with that but so that's what I'm going to be starting with uh, my boyfriend is going to be doing some of these workouts with me as well through social distancing so he's going to be in his house I'm in mine I have no video of him working out I might see if I could get him to send some because I'm sure you guys would like to see him shirtless I know I like seeing him shirtless you might like seeing him shirtless so we'll work on that um, so what do you need for this 2 week challenge well every day for two weeks you have to work out you have to do an ab workout which i will provide for you guys through youtube and mostly my instagram so if you haven't already please follow me on instagram um all of my links for my social media channel channels are in the description box below um obviously you have to do like before and afters um get your measurements diet is a huge part of it um is it not huge i mean let's face it a lot of people's diets are like right now for me i don't know how to put it um i'm kind of eating i'm like in between eating healthy and just not eating i yeah that's not healthy i'm sorry <laughs> but I'm trying to find a nice balance and obviously with only being able to get to the grocery store every now and then like and only so many things being available in the grocery store now it's kind of hard to do all of my favorite recipes that I would normally do or really experiment because you don't know when you're going to get back to the store you don't know if you're going to find these things when you go to the store so cooking is a little unpredictable right now but I am doing my best to stay on track with the healthy eating, um, keeping snacking to a bare minimum. I've also been trying to cut back on dairy. I don't know if you notice, I'm a little less nasal now. It's not like super cool. Um, yeah, so the first thing I'm going to do is do my measurements and I'm doing it live on camera for you guys so you can't say that I lied and like photoshopped anything. So, you ready? Alright.
exercises that you saw me do as you can see I had a lot of interruptions hi can you pass me on the phone no. so yeah working out with kids is very very difficult but it's not impossible and I want to encourage you guys even if you have kids keep pushing get them involved they probably will have more fun than you because it's not, stop rubbing your face on my phone because it's not like they even understand exactly what they're doing so for them it's fun for us it's like yeah um but the exercises felt pretty good only one of them i really struggled with that's the third one because i have back issues but um in the last one i found a substitution and that really helped i didn't even realize it was the last round um i think i took about three to five minute breaks in between each round just to catch myself, drink some water. Crap, I just realized I have my Fitbit on and I did not track this workout at all. Um, so if you have fitness trackers, um, Fitbits, whatever, make sure you log all of your workouts because it really is going to help you to keep track of what you're doing um, and whatever other bougie reason people use Fitbit. So, so did you guys enjoy that video of my boyfriend doing the workout? Isn't he like, oh, see what I go through ladies? Alright, so if you have a significant other, I also challenge you to challenge them to do this with you. It's going to be a lot of fun, trust me. Getting fit together is a great way to stay connected. It's a great way to bond and share so much. Because, I mean, obviously you want to be fit, you want to be in shape, but if you have a partner to do it with, you have your accountability and someone to share some of this pain with and hopefully give you a rub down afterwards, but social distancing, so sorry, solo rub downs for now. So if you guys like this workout, give this video a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe, head over to my Instagram account to get daily videos in my stories for the next two weeks. And yeah, let's bring back Hot Girl Summer. Bye guys.